I just recently uh, bypassed a glow plug relay switch on a Ford, an 83 Ford 6.9 diesel. And uh, I was having a real lot of trouble having, finding any information about how to do this online, so I figured I'd just do a quick tutorial on it since I just did it and it's working. Um, first, I replaced all the glow plugs. Um, I took the air cleaner off the engine so that you could see where the harness is, which is the glow plugs are right here. And they're right next to each injector all the way down the line, four on each side. This is your harness. And it goes to a glow plug controller, which is way back here. These things are really expensive, and they're um, somewhat, I guess, notorious for burning out. Um, so I just decided to not replace it, to bypass that, and use this relay with a momentary switch that I mounted on the dash to do it by hand. Um, that way I can control the time that the glow plugs are on and, and when they turn on. A couple of things, the glow plugs, um, if they're old, they can swell up and they can seize up. So uh, be careful when you replace them, you're gonna need a 3 8 deep socket. And they're kind of hard to get to in here because of the fuel lines and stuff. But um, if you have the correct wrenches and, and uh, adapters, you'll be able to get in there and get that socket on there and get them out. Just, again, be careful. You don't want to break these things off in there because it becomes really, really difficult to get them out. I put a little bit of permeating oil on here um, and just slowly eased them out and they all came out really nice and clean. And then I, uh, I took that. So how this works is I took the glow plug relay. I replaced it with a new one. Um, the old one wasn't working. And then the 12 volts that needs to get to the harness this harness right here carries 12 volts to each one of the glow plugs. The 12 volts comes from the battery, from this post to that post, then the glow plug relay switches on from the ignition. Um, usually it's this switch, you'll, you'll see on, on yours if you have it, you'll see this, this uh, wire right here will be on this post. I pulled it off and I ran a new wire to a momentary switch. I just ran it up along here and through the firewall to a momentary push button switch that I mounted on the dashboard right here. And I got the 12 volts from when I turned the key on, there's 12 volts in this wire right here. So I just connected it right there. Then I get that 12 volts that I need when I push this button, it goes to the glow plugs and uh, turns that relay on, and then I can start it. So, try it out. I got a push button start on this truck too, so turned it on, ignition's on, I got power. So I'm gonna push this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, which is, I guess, the recommended time. And then push button start. Bam. So it's a pretty simple fix, and it's great because you bypass all of that wiring and all that extra stuff that used to be on here, and you can control it manually, which will save the life of your glow plugs and make it easy to start these things in the cold. I had, like I said, so much trouble starting this thing. I, had, I, I was using started, starter fluid for a long time, now this thing just starts right up. So, I hope this helps. This truck is awesome. I've heard a lot of great things about the 6.9, and I'm looking forward to keeping this thing on the road for, for a long, long time. So, I hope this helps you uh, figure out your, your glow plug situation. Uh, for nice, easy starts and cold mornings.